How to solve the OLE action error in Excel. I'll explain why it's happening and provide three fixes. Let's get started. Do you ever encounter the frustrating OLE action error message when you're working in a spreadsheet? Well, you're not alone. This is a really common error with a super simple fix. Let's dive into what this error message means and most importantly, what you can do about it. Your first question is probably, what exactly is an OLE action? OLE is an abbreviation for Object Linking and Embedding, which is an action developed by Microsoft to allow Office applications to work with other applications. This tool enables an editing program to send and receive document data between apps. For example, when Excel attempts to communicate with PowerPoint, the program sends the command to the OLE object and then waits for a response. So why exactly do you keep getting the OLE error message? There are a few causes. First, the DDE protocol might be disabled within Excel. Second, a corrupt Microsoft Office application may have been installed. Third, there might be too many conflicting add-ins with the Excel sheet. Now here's what you've been waiting for. How to fix the Excel is waiting for OLE action error message. First, you should restart your computer. The most common solution when you see the Microsoft Excel is waiting for another application to complete an OLE action. Error message is to restart your system and try again. When you've restarted your computer, check to see if the error message continues to appear. Another common reason Excel users receive the OLE action error when trying to open their Excel file is due to the DDE application feature. To remove this potential issue, you can ignore other applications that use DDE. Under File, select Options, then Advance. Under General, check Ignore Other applications that use DDE. Then restart Excel. After disabling DDE, if you are still getting the OLE action error message, it's time to disable add-ins. This error message can occur because too many add-ins are running at once. To disable add-ins under File, Select Options, then Add-ins. Select Excel Add-ins from the drop-down menu and click Go. Uncheck the add-ins that you are not actively using and click OK, then Restart Excel. After attempting all the other troubleshooting methods, if you are still seeing the Excel OLE Action Error message, you can disable Compatibility Mode. To disable Compatibility Mode, first, close your Excel file. Change the Excel file extension to .exe. And then click Yes. Right-click the file to open Properties. Under the Compatibility Mode, this select Run this program in compatibility mode. Apply your changes and then click OK. Change the file extension back to .xlsx and click Yes. Open the file to test if the OLE action error has been resolved. 